Guilford County Schools is kicking off the upcoming school year with at least nine weeks of remote learning due to the coronavirus pandemic. We know that the school board voted six to three in favor of the decision. This was all during yesterday's virtual meeting. As part of the district's reopening plan, students will be able to return to the classroom for in-person instruction no sooner than October 20th. But before students return to campus, the school board will review public health data and trends concerning the COVID-19 crisis. The board plans on discussing and choosing the re-entry scenario at an upcoming meeting. Well, the board also approved calendar modifications during yesterday's meeting to bring the district school calendars into compliance with a new state law approved back in May. Well, it requires all North Carolina public schools to start on August 17th, except for non-traditional schools. Well, Superintendent Dr. Sharon Contreras is asking parents for patience and understanding during these uncertain times. What I do want the parents to understand is that we hear them and we care, but essentially what school districts were told was good luck. You know, it's the pandemic, good luck, work it out, superintendent, work it out, school boards and we're doing the best we can, but we're not public health officials and we don't have a lot of resources, but we're trying to still provide for their children and to take care of the families. Guilford County Schools is joining 41 other school districts right here in North Carolina who plan on kicking off the school year with remote learning. For more details on that, all you have to do is visit our website. That's WFMYNews2.com.